deal with. So I'd like you all to give them a thought. Mm -hmm. I suppose you know who they are. Um, Lamont Young, you know, the great minimalist and also supporter of Pandit Pramnath when he came to New York. So I'm going to ring this bell and I'd appreciate if we could all just think of them and send send our best wishes. Okay. And I'm going to ring a second bell to their disciple, Junhi Choi, who's bearing a lot of the weight of their diminished powers and who has done very, very much in the last decade to keep them going. And now I'll read my poem. Uh, L, M, and M. Butterflies keep dropping on my sarangi while bombs keep falling on people's heads. Dear teachers, can you explain this to me? As I contemplate the richness of your love, all the while wondering, while the tortoises in my bathtub still have not taught me the perfect allegories of dream and incantation. While we await the metaphoric collapse of the vast metropolis, in which our highest aspirations were assembled, an entire species facing extinction as we sing of the miraculous. Here, in the vestige of prayer and incantation, still gathered the flock, the wild birds, the ancient understood as the butterflies, as the bombs fell. Uh, I'd like to read that again. Is it all right with you? It's okay. <laughs> <laughs>